this is the first ever spread I did in my Recollections Planet. It is the All the Fun of the Fair kit from the Plump Planner and it was September the 28th till, no August the 28th till September the 3rd. We went to the seaside this week. This is my September monthly spread using a kit from Lucinda Charlotte. I've used a September Wacky Holidays from Your World of Colour on here. This is September 4th through to the 10th with a Girl Boss kit from Planner Face. This is the week the girls went back to school after the summer holidays. Don't think there was much else that went on this week. This is September 11th to the 17th using the sweater weather kit from Lucinda Charlotte. Love the colours in this, they're perfect for going into fall. Don't think there was anything too big on that week. This is the 18th to the 24th using the Pumpkin Fields kit from It's Just Paper Co. Nothing much else went on. I did make my first order with Willa Wallaco. This is the 25th to the 1st of October using the Fashion Fall kit from Wendy Prince. Very busy week this was, more for cleaning anyway. Wanted to make sure the house was all ready for when Christmas came round. This is my October monthly and the kit was from Temp Loves Crafts. Again, I used the October Wacky Holidays from Your World of Colour. This is the 2nd to the 8th. And it is the I Am Fashion Kit from Lucinda Charlotte. This is the 9th to the 15th and it's the Wicked Kit from Kimmy's Studio. I think that's how you pronounce it. I love the little fox onesie sticker. This is the 16th to the 22nd using the Haunted Kit from It's Just Paper Co. And this is the 23rd to the 29th using the Halloween Kit from Your World of Colour. I love this kit. She even changed the headers from where it says little things. It said spooky things. And then some of the other headers were different as well. I really love doing this kit. I hope she brings another one out like this for this Halloween. Moving on, this is my October, my November monthly using a kit from Lucinda Charlotte. I didn't fill in this that much, but still a pretty kit. This is October the 30th to the 5th. This is Halloween week using a kit from Harriet Wright Designs. It was called Happy Halloween. Don't think I had much going on this week. Had an appointment at the school and the girls went back to school this day as well. On to the 6th of November to the 12th. This is the Autumn Leaves kit from Green Donna Designs. Nothing fun happened this week. I think it's because it's November. You just had Halloween and then you're stuck before Christmas comes. 13th of November to the 19th. This was called Apple Picking from Tracy Ray's, I think you call it. Uh, my eldest had a school trip this week yeah. 
This is the 20th to the 26th and it's called Pumpkin Spice and it was a bunch of mixed shops. I think there's a Harriet Wright Designs and another shop that I can't remember the name of. This is the 27th to the 3rd, so this is when December started and this is the Christmas shopping kit from Planning with C. This is where I started using some of my Christmas Fox and Cactus stickers. They were the mermaid ones I think with red hair and um, I think they're exclusive, you can only purchase them at certain times when they're put in the shop. This is my December monthly and it was from Bite Prints. Um, in this one I used the Wacky Holidays from Once More with Love. I think they're so cute. I like how small they are. This is the first full week in December. It's the 4th to the 10th and this was a mixed kit um, called Sweet Christmas from Away with the Fairies. I also pulled in some Your World of Colour stickers as well. This is the 11th to the 17th. It is the Noel kit from Moodle Madoodles as well as a full bo uh, a double box from Wendy Prince and some other bits from Wendy Prince in there as well. I made a lot of use of my Christmas functional characters in here like my Fox and Cactus ones, Once More with Love and Coffee Monsters Co. This is the week before Christmas and it's the Wonderland kit from Cinderella Paper. I love my little Coffee Monster Co countdown stickers at the bottom. I think you could also purchase these in blue which I think I did so instead of buying more I might just use those ones this year. This was Christmas week and it it's called Tis the Season from Lucinda Charlotte. I didn't have managed to fill in this week, obviously because it was Christmas, so I didn't fill that one in. This is my January monthly using a kit from Green Dana Designs. I also used her Wacky Holiday stickers. These were small ones as well. Nothing much going on apart from bills and that. This is the Midnight Kit from Those Silly Stars who is no longer a shop and Strawberry Lime Designs. This is New Year's Day week and the week the girls went back to school. This is the Prosecco Please Kit from Harriet Wright Designs. Nothing much on this week. I think I was just getting back into planning after not being able to do too much during the Christmas holidays. This is the Snowy Nights kit from Oodle Madoodles. Um, not much this week either. Um, did use a nice cute sticker from Whimsical Cat Co, I think it's called. This is the Woodland Friends kit from Anything Elsie. I think this is a very cute kit. Um, nothing much on this week. This is my February monthly. I used a kit from Green Dana Designs again and also Your World of Colour Wacky Holidays. This was my partner's birthday month, also Valentine's Day. This is the Coffee Morning Kit from Harriet Wright Designs. Um, nothing much going on this week. I did use one of those lovely Willa Walla Co. Gertie Unicorn stickers. I think they're so cute. Shame I can't order from that shop anymore because shipping's gone up. This is the Mr. Grey kit from Harriet Wright Designs. 
This is a lovely kit and I love how this spread turned out. Not much on this week. Apart from it was my partner's birthday on the 8th. But that was about it for this week. Um, I can't remember what this kit is called, but it is from Lucinda Charlotte. This was Valentine's week. Uh, apart from that, I don't think there was anything else on this week. Oh, and it was the Planner Block Sale on the 18th. This is the Good Morning Valentine kit from Lily and Miko. Nothing on this week. Very quiet week this was. This is my March monthly. Didn't really fill this in much, but it was from um, Lucinda Charlotte. Quite a few things going on this month, St. Patrick's Day, um, Mother's Day, clocks went forward, and it was my birthday month as well. This is the XOXO kit from Lucinda Charlotte. Um, not much this week. Um, I did have a few my uncle's funeral to go to this week. Um, the girls had a non-uniform day. I think if I remember rightly, then there was snow all over the weekend. So not much filled in for this week. This is the Spring Picnic Kit from Lucinda Charlotte. This was where I really started getting into planning my YouTube videos, as you can see. This was Mother's Day weekend. Um, don't think there was anything else. This is the Storybook Kit from Kelsabeth Plans. Um, this was St. Patrick's Day week, also it was my stepbrother's birthday this week as well. Apart from that there was nothing else going on. This was my birthday week and a very busy week. Uh, my youngest had a concert at school on the 19th, she plays the flute. It was the first day of spring on the 20th, my birthday was the 21st, my eldest had a concert on the 22nd, she plays the violin, my youngest then had a school trip on the 23rd, clocks went forward on the Saturday night and my eldest went to a reborn doll convention with nanny and granddad on the Sunday. So this was a very busy week. This was the Oodle Madoodles kit birthday surprise. This is the last week of March and it was the Easter parade kit from the Plump Planner because this was Easter Sunday week. Uh, the girls also broke up for Easter on the Thursday. Uh, apart from that I don't think there was anything else going on this week. These are all the spreads I'm going to show you now and then I will do another flip through in December. So from April to December will be up on my channel then. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the like button and I will see you in my next one.